Haya, karibuni. <laughs> Welcome back to Full Circle with Mukali. And, you know, this is just awkward. I don't even know how to handle this situation because her royal's coffiness is in the building and she is seated. I am seated, guys. This is awkward. Welcome to the show, Asante. Kofi Asante. and Andy. Karibuni sana kwenye show. Mm. So, umeamua, what's going on? Nimeamua. Ume boycott. Do you have an injury? Let's just start there. <laughs> Are you hurting? No, no, no. Did no. you uh, overwork yourself? I'm good to go. Okay. Uh, I just decided we need to have a conversation about everything we've actually been doing, all okay. the workouts we've been working on. Uh -huh. And um, it's really necessary because fitness, kuna theory na kuna the practice. The okay. practical so, leo part. Amua to class leo theory. sasa tumengi a class, we just dive in it. Andy, were you given this memo? Are you, you were ready to go? I was given at a short notice. <laughs> but uh, there's no you, problem about it. There's no problem. Yes, I'm if always you work ready. out, you talk while working out. Sure, so yeah, sure. we're going to do the work. But if you have any uh, demonstrations to show, yeah. please yeah. feel free. Yeah. Yeah. So we're talking about, you know, weight loss and yeah. how sometimes we go to the gym, we eat the right things and nothing yeah. is happening. Mm. Yes. You work out, you sweat, nothing is happening. Mm. Six months in. And I don't know if it's a mental thing that mm. we expect everything to happen immediately mm -hmm. or nini nini na Andy, so idea to work because Andy gets so many ladies wana kuja and nataka hii mwili ya Valentine's. Mimi nataka ya ya birthday yangu July. Unasikia? Ndio hizo sasa. July eh nini? Swim body. Yes. Nilikuwa nataka kusema hiyo ingine lakini bikini body. Bikini body. Yes. That's the word I was looking for. Yeah. Yes. July. And you're very right. Yes. You see the the the, the key thing here is we have a mental setup within ourselves that we are expecting this within this period of time. Yes. And uh, we want it to happen by all means. Yes. Like whatever, whatever, it, takes. whatever it takes, this has to happen. Mm -hmm. But you see, there's that realistic perspective that you need to have. Okay. Because in fitness, we always talk about setting goals, mm -hmm. but the goals have to be very, very, very realistic. Mm -hmm. okay. So say your birthday is in two weeks, and now you're saying, I need to have a bikini body. <laughs> you know, it definitely, chances of it happening, zero zero you see yes. and now when it doesn't happen you see they're kind of and he's not even a good trainer <laughs> yeah and he doesn't even know how to do the boot camp <laughs> 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 yeah? that is the issue yeah. so yes. all the all the kind of backlash goes back to the trainer you know mm. but we always say at the beginning of it all we have to sit down the way we are, we are sitting down right now okay we talk about it because most people think that it's just something you step in the gym for instance and then results are also instant. It doesn't yes. happen that way. Okay. Mm. So sitting down and talking and discussing, trying to also assist someone to set smart goals, mm. it's very, very important. Mm. Okay. So that you see that it's actually a process. It's not something that you're doing it. It's, it's not a destination. Yes. So it's not something you're setting up and saying, I'm going to reach here within this period of time mm. and it has to be tomorrow. No, mm. it's going to take time okay. and you have to be ready for it that it's going to take time. Okay. Yeah. So I'm assuming a mentor. Also because of setting those two short term uh, expectations yeah. and you want to move things faster, you tend to push your body too much. Yes. So now instead of it losing that weight, it starts holding on to that weight. Yeah. Why? Because when I stress. Remember, oh. we keep saying the body has to be in, in homeostasis. Yes. Your state Homeostat of balance. Ationi, nini. State of balance. Only say my own theory. So it has to homeostasis. It has to be qua state of balance, and state of balance is your well-being, even mentally, yeah. how you're sleeping, how you're eating. Like, don't lose too much. Don't put in too much. Yeah. So because we want to bikini body in two weeks. By the way, he was talking about me. My birthday is in two weeks. What? I know he was. Like this, you a bikini body. No. Ile sculptures as I lay down. No, so do you have the body too much? Yes. So it ends up holding on to everything you have yeah. Yeah. because you're even depriving it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so okay. you have to be you have to be moderate oh, okay. in whatever it is you're doing. Yeah. So realistic goals. Yeah. You have to understand that at the end of the day, bado utakriv. Mm. You'll crave for your crusher, you'll crave for your milkshake, you'll crave for your your chicken, your pizza, you'll crave for it and it's fine to crave for it. Yes. But just know if I crave for it and I eat it, how do I get it out and how mm. do I get back mm. to my routine? Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. That's interesting. So mental state mm. and expectations should mm. be in line. Yes. yes. What are the things in terms of like working out? Why do we see some people in the gym for so long mm. but unona change 
Nikamama, is it the type of exercises mm. we do? Well, there's a bit of food as mm. well. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> let's. It, it, it's it's very it's very wide. Yeah. From nutrition to how you recover to even the type of training that you have. Mm -hmm. uh, so for the nutrition, it's uh, I'm I'm always against dieting. I've always been saying, and I've been stoned, and it's fine. Keep stoning me. You'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it, mm. but don't diet i keep saying diets are for when when guys are on extremes yeah maybe you have a condition or yeah. you're you're obese so i mean we have to put you on a diet yes. but if you're just working out kama sisi kawaida just eat your meals portion control yes, yes. eat your meals and work out okay all right so to work a nutrition candle let's talk about the working out the actual workout mm -hmm. like are you just coming because i see i see so many people mtu wana, mtu wana um, so i've done the treadmill for 10 minutes and then i've done my sit-ups there and then i've done my mountain climbers yeah should be good to go i'm like sour you should be good to go mm -hmm. if all you're looking for is just the general yeah. fitness yeah Ah, see bikini oh. body. See bikini yeah. body. So okay, if you want yeah. the bikini body, then you have to move more. So whatever you did, that 10 minutes, your sit-ups and your mountain climbers, that was just the warm-up. Yeah. So oh. you cannot leave after you do that. That's when you may warm up. Because mm -hmm. again, we keep saying you have to elevate your heart rate from, like right now, the three of us, we are at resting heart rate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we have to elevate it. Do you keep a to one zezo ezi? Yeah. Unaona? Kwa sababu kwa elevate tu mtu alishachoka. Sasa sasa lazima hakuna otherwise. Anafanya ile kitu ya kuhema si panting. I also think you see uh, your body has a way of limiting itself within mm. a given range. Mm. Okay. So for you to see results you really need to push yourself a little bit outside the limits. Okay. Yes. Because say if you're doing 10 reps, mm. okay? Uh, reps are repetitions. Mm -hmm. Now you're doing 10 repetitions and your body gets used to only 10. So mm. you check in the gym, you're only doing 10. Yes. You, you, whenever you try to do the 11th, mm. the mm. body is automatically going to tell you, no, no, no. Mm. Look, mm. we are used to 10. Mm. Yeah. Let's just settle on 10. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. But now for that, you see, you, you definitely are not going to see a lot of results. Or you might see very minimal kind of results over a very long, okay, protract protracted time. Mm. Okay. So the key thing here is for you to try your level best mm. to push yourself just outside your limits. Mm. Just outside your limits. Today, say you've walked for 10 minutes. Tomorrow you can walk 15. Mm. Okay. Keep on progressing. When you are doing weights, we always call it progressive overload. You mm. know, if today you are able to push uh, 20 kgs, mm. tomorrow you can push 22, mm. 24, mm. 25, you know. Yes. And uh, all those kind of different things. Uh, variations mm. and amounts for, for, for the weights are always available. Mm. Now, if you cannot access the gym mm. and uh, say it's something, say you're running, you wake up in the morning to run. Mm -hmm. uh, if on Monday you ran, say, for 30 minutes, try the next time when you're running, mm. just add another five minutes. Yeah. Okay. You know, there's also a way that your body is going to register that, hey, look, the next one, we have to push mm, a mm. bit more. Yes, just a little bit more. Okay. So the problem with most people is, you know, we are used to a given routine mm. and we do not want to break out of that routine. It's okay. like if I break out, no, 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 you know, I might get an injury. I might get too fatigued and stuff mm. like that. Okay. So okay. we are afraid. That kind of fear, when it grows in you, then you're just going to, to be checking in and doing your bare minimum. Mm. Now, you okay. see, when you do bare minimum, you get bare minimum results. Mm. Yes. So that is how it works. Okay. That is why some people are in the gym for so long. Yes. But mm. they are totally, there's no change. Because mulia yes. yes. You're not pushing yes. yourself to the yes. extra limit. Yes. yes. But is there kuna kwanga na ile ya watu nasema, like the gents will be like, mimi singyangi ile class ya kuruka ruka. And kuna yungu nasema, if you want to get into mm. the, what is it, it has a name. Heat aerobics. Aerobics, yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. So um, if, if, if like uh, I want to lose a lot of weight, scare. Mm. imagine in the aerobics, you mm. you sweat more, mm. it's better than lifting weight. Mm. Are there truths around that? I mean, it's just, you know, conversational different things work for different people. You know, it was bro science. Allah? <laughs> you know, when wana kujanga and then <laughs> when they guide each other, uko, yeah, yeah. Yeah. that's yeah. called bro science. It's just wrong. It has a name? Yeah, it's called bro science. What? It's just, it's, yes. it's just you guys wrong. You guys are bullies. Come and start yeah, like, like look uh, at them. Bro yeah, yeah, that's bro yeah, yeah. going on over there. Because okay. you see, when yeah. you're training, you have to obey all aspects of training. Yes. 
and your trainer should be able to guide you through that. Okay. There's strength. Yeah. We have endurance, which is masculine endurance. You yeah. have your cardio. You have your hypertrophy for for buff guys. No, no, no. And then you have your power. And then sasa uko katikati you have things like flexibility, mobility and stability. Yeah. Now those three zina kujanga as you continue working out. Okay. Okay. Now, the class for aerobics it gives you basic cardio. Okay. When you decide to lift weights, it gives you strength. Now, how do you even get these things like power and hypertrophy? Hypertrophy is for guys who want to buff, buff up, up, like, 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 Yeah, you see, uh, but I'm not saying that even if you don't want to buff, you cannot do it. Yes. So you'll find someone who, and I was actually having this conversation with him, someone who is lifting weights cannot even do a 15 minutes aerobics class and yeah. that's just you cannot call yourself fit mm -hmm. yeah. if you can't do it like that yeah you cannot call you shouldn't even call yourself fit. you should say you're on the journey to becoming fit i don't care how big your muscles are yeah because you see fitness is all rounded yes now unless now you're an athlete and your main focus is maybe if you're if you're if you're doing rugby you're focusing on speed if you're yeah. Flanker, yeah. Yes. Yes. yeah. 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 Mm. and maybe if you're a footballer you're looking for agility if maybe you're a wrestling person you're looking unona how work on a customized way of training but even then you can't tell me a football guy, even if they're not uh, buff, they don't have strength, they, they do. Yeah. So you cannot tell me you, you won't do an aerobics class, but you lift weights. Or yes. you won't lift weights because you do an, an aerobics class. Mm. You have to have a mix of both. And okay. that's why trainers are there. Unless your trainer is just another bro science buddy, yeah. <laughs> trainers are yeah. supposed to guide you. Because even how you're training your client, it's not every day we are doing strength. No. It's not every day we are doing cardio. Yes. It's not every day we are doing power. Yeah. Sometimes a client and a kuja <coughs> and we're just stretching. Yeah. Because it's part of fitness. So even for aerobics, first of all, aerobics is even, uh, it's steady, it's called a steady state, uh, let's even call it environment. Yeah. It's very good for fat burn. But you cannot do it for 20 minutes and then you tell me you've, you're done. You're done. Yeah. 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 And it's actually different. Like Monday will be a different class. Exa yes, exactly. Exactly. Yes. Will, will be different. Yeah. There, there are weights that That's are going to be inculcated mm. in some workouts. Yeah. So That's it's why it's very important for gyms to have um, a day for heat, mm. a day for aerobics, a day for toning, a day for yoga or yeah. for something yeah. sour. If you don't uh, if you don't have access to the gym, if you're YouTube, you're YouTube training yourself, don't just be doing every day. You're just doing aerobics uh, every day. Room banners. Zumba, Siku, you are, are just fun. dancing yes. and yeah. it's fine it's <laughs> going to get you somewhere uh -huh. Uh -huh. Do, don't get me wrong yeah. if you're just doing zumba it's gonna it's gonna give you the flexibility yes, yes. all right yeah. it's gonna give you the sort of endurance actually mm. you're gonna get some yeah. endurance mm. but you're not gonna get stronger from just dancing no, no. Mm. so you have to find some days where you're clicking us on tuesday here at switch tv yes. and we are doing heat and yes. we are doing push-ups it's gonna give you that upper body strength exactly. so you have to train in an all-rounded kind of way that's why they say train like an athlete yeah yeah don't just train at mm -hmm. and actually there's something you're saying um you don't train what you don't train body parts you train muscles you're, you train specific oh, wow. muscles mm. it's not okay. it's not body parts huh? mm. okay we train for specific muscle mm. groups because you see uh even if i'm <coughs> training my chest huh? the yes. chest has different muscles yes. yeah so and that is why we have different variations and different kind of exercises okay mm. all coupled together mm. for the purpose of training my my chest mm. okay. the same thing applies to legs everywhere mm. you know so but i wanted to come to her point and just say that uh you see fitness has to be approached from a holistic perspective mm. that's true yeah you know it's a state of mind but mm -hmm. also it's physical mm. but definitely what is going to happen first is going to be the change of the mindset, mindset. Mm. the mindset is going to change yes. but sometimes you might not be able to see instant or you know immediate uh, physical, physical change, changes change. Mm. but the mind has to change okay so if you are into fitness mm. you need to be able to be versatile and that is why even if you step to any gym you know we have different things that we do even as trainers mm. yes you need to be a trainer who can be able to do many different kind of things mm. it's it's a whole big industry but it has different smaller uh, kind of for disciplines. different mm. things yes for different things because you see <coughs> when a client steps at the door and they are coming and they want you to train them yes. and say you do not know exactly oh. how to approach their goals how are you gonna do it yes. i walk out 
Yes. And you see, we've seen this, I think, on the show as well mm. with yeah. uh, a scholar showing if you can't do this, then you can do this. Yes. Yeah. Meaning there are people who with ha where they have knee problems, yes. yeah. they have back yeah. problems. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. as a trainer, you need to have the alternative yeah, because yes. for that client. Yeah. Yes. We are going to take a short break. <laughs> <laughs> scholar and Andy will be here. Please stream in your questions. We're going to be looking at them and mm. having Andy and Scholar just answer those for you. Hashtag hey, hey, hey. Keep moving, hey. y'all. <laughs> we'll be right back. Yeah. Welcome back to Full Circle with Mukali. I have Scholar and Andy in the building. We're talking about why you go to the gym and somehow, somehow, you're not losing weight. And if that is your goal, nothing is happening. And we have a question here on our SMS line. That is triple one, triple four, triple one. It's just a shilling. To my ear, Maswali, Scholar and Andy. Today we're just seated. Relax, scholar, just <laughs> chilling over here. <laughs> <laughs> it's my high Mikali, please read this. So doing just that. Mm -hmm. I have that problem. I have been working out for a couple of months mm. and my tummy is not trimming. Mm. What should I do? I'm almost giving up. Okay. So been working out for three couple almost. of months. Mm -hmm. Couple of months, they say. So mm -hmm. I don't know couple couple is like maybe two even two yeah yeah um how do they train mm. what are they eating those two things how are they sleeping oh that matters how are they recovering yes. okay how is their hormonal balance mm. yeah so many things but let's talk about how are they training okay. what are they doing are they sport training because if you're sport training that's just wrong same thing he was talking about he what doesn't sport, tra training? sport training is when you literally train that particular sport Oh, see, see, sasa, now when I Because you, you want tummy, tummy loss, or rather, yeah. Yes. Yeah, the so tummy to go away. So now, every day, yeah, yeah. you're just sit doing, you're just doing sit-ups, mm. yes. you're doing crunches, you're doing yes. everything. Let me give you an example, sawa. Okay. So, uh, me and Andy, we both want weight loss, kwa tumbo, sawa. Yes. Technically, it's just me, it's not him. It's fine. Um, <laughs> uh, so, Andy decides every day, he'll be doing crunches, leg raises, like three workouts for just the core. Yeah. Yeah. I decide I'm going to approach this fitness from a, holist a, a holistic way, because or rather I'll be doing compound workouts. Yeah. What are my compound workouts? Let me yeah. just pick even three. I'll be doing my squats, yes. uh, and then I'll be doing my burpees, yeah. and then I'll be doing my lunges. Yeah. Okay. Workouts. Kila mtu anajua, all right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Sawa. So we are all going to get somewhere. Don't get me wrong. Yes. He's going to get, he's going to be building on core strength. Because he's doing the crunches, the sit-ups, yeah. the leg He's building on core strength. Mm -hmm. But he might not necessarily see his abs because basically when you're on a image feature. Yeah. It's not that they are not there, they yeah. are. But the image feature, they are underneath your layer of fat. Uh, I mean, fat is fat. So, who can strength your core? Yes, who can strength your core? Like, one big pack. Who can yes. one big pack? Now, me, on the other hand, yes. I am doing compound workouts. What are compound workouts? Compound workouts are workouts that target more than one muscle group. Okay. Like, say I do a burpee. Going up, going down. Mm. Let me even demonstrate. Please do. So, if it's a burpee, sorry, Andy. Yeah. So, it's up, down, yeah. back up, down. It step even up. has a variation where you can just step, yeah. step, and up, you down. down. You, you, you don't have to get all the way down, but yeah. if you can, you go all the way down, you come up, yeah. step, step. Sawa. Okay. What am I using here? Everything. E exactly my yes. point. Yes. I'm using everything. I'm using so many muscle groups. And for me to, to be able to move mm -hmm. the way I am moving, yeah. I have to use energy. Where yeah. is energy coming from? Calories. Ah. Where, is, where are calories coming from? Food. Yeah. Yes. So by the time I live there, I have used up so many energy, so much it's energy, so, sorry. So, so many, so <laughs> <I've used laughs> power too. My energy. <laughs> my yes. energy too, So mingi. I've used my energy, Mingi, yes. which translates to the calories that I'm burning. Okay. Now, Andy is just doing, Andy is just doing yeah. your, could be crunches, yes. could be variation, yes. or he's just doing this. Mm -hmm. He's using very little energy. He is working out, yes. but he's using very little energy because of the muscles he's working. He's just working on core. core. Yeah. One muscle. Okay. Okay. Me here, when I'm doing the burpee, mm -hmm. I'm targeting shoulders. That's one muscle group. I'm using my arms. 
that's another and my yeah. arms has what bicep tricep so yeah. that's two yeah. i'm using legs mm. that's another one and okay. i'm also using the the core yeah sawa so, and yeah. i'm also using chest yeah. okay. when we say chest to the ground yeah. so i have like five muscle groups that i'm working on and he has like one yeah mm. just the core mm. Mm. Let's even give it to your lower back because yes. <laughs> yeah. to move yes. That's two, two and yes. I'm working on five. Nani ana ban mo who you are five. Exactly. Yes. We are all doing work yes. but I'm burning more. So yeah. I might see my abs quicker. Yeah. than him. Yes. Yet ah. he is doing that sport training. Same case with someone who just does the squats. Eh? Okay. Yeah. Your work is just to go to the gym. Mm-hmm. You, these are your squats. Eh? You just go to the gym and then after you just look, you're like, okay. <laughs> that's, yeah. that's, that's It's what coming they, together. Yeah. yeah. Mm, so, mm. and I'm just doing squats and I'm expecting results. Him, he could decide he's doing what? A Bulgarian split squat, which is this. Yeah. He, we, are, we all want a big booty and big legs. Yeah. Okay. So, he's doing this and he can do this with dumbbells yeah. or he can have the barbell that's yeah. called a Bul- Bulgarian split squat so down yeah, and yeah. up he mm-hmm. could decide he'll be doing the side yeah okay. all right okay. he could decide he'll be doing not just the squats but he could play around with everything so at a pattern more growth yeah than where we mwenye una sport train okay. so sport training is not good so maybe that's why anaona there's no Um, change change yeah. in the time yet she is working out let's not take away yeah, let's not take that not away wo- from she her she is working out yes, she is yes. working out because yes. sometimes the the workout cuz you could find that she's eating really well cuz mm. she knows she wants to lose the tummy so yes. she's going to have to eat well at yes. least portion control at least mm. check on what you're eating mm. sawa yeah. mm-hmm. but the workouts don't spot train i see people just come to the gym they're just doing side bends even See, Even the type of what like when you work <laughs> just remember when you're working on your obliques eh? yes. that is your love handles eh? yes. and every day you're just doing this yes yes you want to take it away <laughs> kindly i may just take it away by saying this yes. Yes. there's totally nothing like sport training yes. like it doesn't exist mm. and you shouldn't get it's engaged in it like mm. yeah it's a huge scam yes because you see by the time you're having fat layer around mm. your abdominals it's everywhere you see you start gaining fat from every other part of mm. the body mm. it does not you, you do not just eat then the fat is converted then it just lies here like no it does yeah yes. it's now everywhere just because you're seeing it there yes. doesn't mean that it's yes. not everywhere yes, yeah, this one becomes extremely more visible yes. Yes. you see when your cheeks if you look at yourself in the mirror you can definitely see that hey you become chubby yeah. yes it starts there it starts like and it's f- fat stores everywhere yes mm. so once it now is so internal it mm. now starts protruding outside and now you can be able to see it mm. so you shouldn't uh, have a program where mm. you're telling yourself i just want to train this particular mm. you know but yeah but this part of hapa uh, uh, it and it doesn't work hapa and, 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 and let me just say this ladies have that thing so yes, much you know true. Yeah, I just want my booty and then yeah, yeah, yeah the upper two please upper two, yeah. Yeah. Mm. If, if it just becomes flat I'm done. Yeah, so okay. when you tell them look we shall also have some push-ups they're like, yes. like why should I, I do that? I don't need arms, yeah, I, I don't, don't need, need a chest. I'm like, you need a chest. <laughs> do we? <laughs> we have questions here. Yeah. Hi Mukali, I am slim but I have a tummy. What can I do to reduce the tummy? I think it's generally everything you say here. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. they're slim. Yeah, you find that as we are saying fat stores everywhere yeah uh you'll find in uh, uh cc wasjana it starts here yes. but it doesn't mean it won't go anywhere else uh, it just starts here mm-hmm. so you'll find your slim and once if you're slim and the ka- the katam it's not it's never this one it's, it's always the, the lower yeah, one yeah, just know it's your eating Ah, yeah, it's okay, your eating. Okay. You're you're in surplus. Yes, you're mm. eating more than yeah, you're yes, moving. Because so yeah, you're on caloric surplus. Because I keep saying, moving doesn't have to be the burpees or yeah. the lunges or the squats. <sighs> moving could be even washing clothes. Yeah, yeah. doing yeah. laundry could mm. be doing dishes. But if you're eating more than the energy you're using, you're, you're using, yes. then you're just going to the the yeah. cheeks, the hands, yeah. and the yeah. whatnot. So okay. you have to move more than what is coming in. Just okay. to avoid that kind of sedentary lifestyle, <coughs> yeah. which, right. which is a big problem for most people, especially in a city like Nairobi. Yeah. yeah. We drive here, park, walk to the office, yes. drive back home. Yes. Hi, we call it Swashi from Rirom, asking, like, personally, I do work out mm-hmm. for two 
Uh, I do work out for two weeks consistently. Mm -hmm. Then after that, I watch it because I feel muscles hurt. Mm. So how do I keep up the consistency? Hi, where she? Say, mm. what's up, group? All right, where she? Number one, it's completely okay for your muscles to to hurt. They should hurt. They should hurt. Working out is a physical stress yes. on your muscles. As a matter of fact, if we work out and then tomorrow you're just like, hey, you're okay. We didn't. Do, we under trained. Yes. Basically, that's what yes. we did. Yeah, you're supposed to feel something because you pushed your muscles to an extent hijazoa, which is fine. Now, pain is another thing which is just uh, not acceptable because it means you overtrained and yeah. you are you are the risk of getting an injury if you're not injured. Yeah. Okay. So, so the 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 soreness that's fine. Now, for her the, for her to get the consistency that she's looking for, because I said I work two weeks. Alafu wanaacha. Maybe your two weeks, she's she's doing what we talked about when we started the show. She's pushing the body too much. Yeah. So by the third week, she's ah. out. Burnout. She's out. Yeah. Okay. After this, we experience burnout. Because our day-to-day -day life is just lifting Workout. things. Yeah. And we also have to train ourselves. We have to train <coughs> you. We have... Oh, no, no. So you're going to experience it. So how about, instead of doing... Because I see some people, because you really want the weight loss so much. Or you even want the weight gain so much. You're doing seven days a week. No, 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 no. You need yeah. rest. And that's why you need to train um, mu muscle groups. That's why they say you have a program because yeah. you have like you have like a chest ah, day, a work yeah. day, leg each, day. Exactly, thank you. Because each muscle group requires about seventy-two hours to rest yeah. and recover. To recover. Oh, that's why. Yes. Okay. That's why Andy Akifanya legs Monday. Yeah. If he wants to do the legs again, he can only do those legs on Thursday, on Friday. Thursday, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No, na zime pumzika pa katikati, but pa katikati between now Tuesday <coughs> and now the Thursday or Friday, yes. it doesn't mean he's idling. No. No. He probably has his chest day yeah. or his abs day or his back day so you go anisha like that so by the end of the week you've had your rest of mm. your muscles mm -hmm. and you've worked everything okay yes including the yeah. those abs that you want okay yeah, yeah. Uh, another question here we are almost coming to the end of the show so hi mm. Mikali. my cheat way huh? my cheat way to lose tummy fat is to drink green tea with lemon without honey two hours after my supper but I'm worried that it won't work long term mm. to get that flat tummy without burning uh, myself with lemons should i stop and just work out watching in from comero can did you want to take this um i know there's there's always that thing about green tea yes. and lemon yes and, and hot uh, water yes, and yes hot water like apple cider vinegar yeah it's it's and gonna yes. burn those that the fat and and then you're going to lose it no it doesn't work that way oh it doesn't no it doesn't work oh, that god. way she, she, heart breaks yeah she, you need to incorporate in some exercises mm. you know specific exercises that you have to incorporate in having lemon after your meal mm. having some you know green tea after your it's okay it's okay but you know she has to be very purposive about it and she knows what she wants to do actually that's yeah. why she's saying she's thinking of incorporating in some exercises yes. it's very important that she does that because what we are saying is at the end of the day working out covers about 30 percent mm -hmm. what you eat and uh, your lifestyle and every other thing that we do outside the gym covers the rest okay mm. so i feel she's she's doing something She's doing something, yeah. but she's doing it at a very bare minimum. Okay. Mm. So just by doing that and expecting to see results, mm. it really might not work out for her. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Quickly before we close, mm. alcohol and uh, weight loss. <laughs> Scully. <laughs> Scholar. Coffee. No, <laughs> I'm laughing. I, I'm not That's so sure if it's in our SMS or it's just me asking. I'm just, you know, like <laughs> general <laughs> education, information. No, 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 no. I'm laughing because Andy, I'm talking about beer. Not to take beer. <laughs> <laughs> Is that thing true? Like, I hear you say beer, you know, like. <laughs> no, let me leave it to Andy because Andy, <laughs> the, 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 the truth is there's a lot of calories in beer. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The the thing is, as a trainer, yes. if a client comes in and say they are saying they have an alcohol problem, mm. okay. I wouldn't really sit you down to tell you, you have to stop alcohol. No. You know, habits take a while for them to grow. Mm. Yes. And if alcohol taking mm -hmm. is an issue for you, mm -hmm. it definitely has taken a while. Yes. You, you didn't just wake up today and you decided, no, I'm going to be taking alcohol every single day. You started small mm. yes. and then it progressed. Mm. Yes. So you also need that time. It, it needs that progression. Mm. 
for it to also become something that you are okay. uh, possibly planning to stop. Mm. So the key thing here is the way we've said, for you to lose weight, yes. it's caloric deficit. Mm. Mm -hmm. For you to add weight, it's caloric surplus. Yes. Mm. So if you are taking alcohol, but you can be able to take it in moderation. Mm. Then that's good. That's yeah. okay. Okay, that's better. Yes, not good. that's that's better. So better. That's it's better. Like, yeah, yeah, moderation. Yeah. <laughs> Just moderation. You know. Yeah. yeah, and and you see the problem that we are having is yes. most people cannot moderate it. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So you'll say I'll just have a bottle of beer. I think what you need, what happens or should happen yeah. is yeah. you make it very plain for yes. me as a client. Yes. Like if you continue like this. Yes. yes. You see this thing that you want? Yes. yes. This bikini body for July? Yes. Mm. It won't work yeah. out. It won't okay? work out for so, you. So, and there too when the meeting yes. now yourself with yourself time <laughs> young this is me trying to say quite <laughs> okay so uh, maybe your handles and how people can can get in touch um, with you quickly before before yes. malize uh -huh. I, I need us to touch on sleep guys you, you, alaka, alaka. Mm. people have to sleep minimum yes, yes. Eight minimum hours. minimum eight hours yes. eight hours that's yes. why sometimes you're holding on to wait because you have four hours you mm. three hours mm. so okay. please work on your sleep routine Sour. Okay. Yes, and Scoffiness on IG. Yes. I'll take you through everything else from there. Okay. Yeah. Andy underscore Buffy on Instagram, uh, Body Justice Fitness on Facebook. Okay. And Andy Mai also on Facebook. Awesome. Yes. Thank you guys. <laughs> Time is out. But I want to quickly wish Novets a happy, happy birthday. She is my assistant producer. I wish you all the best day. May your age and your new age be blessed. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for tuning in. Let's do this all over again tomorrow. Thank you. Adios. Thank you.